Yo, what's up everyone? I hope you're having a great day. Today we are going to do a FL Studio setup and unboxing of the Mo Moki? Mo Mookie? McCoy? You stupid! Yep. Unboxing and review setup of the Moki audio interface. So, without further ado, let's go. Alright, so if you were like me, you hopped into FL Studio, you had your microphone to your left, your Moki audio interface to your right, connected them both, and nothing came up. Well, that can be due to a lot of things, but the two main problems for Windows is that your input for your audio interface was not connected to your input for Windows. So, you're going to want to go into Settings, click on Sound, and go into your Inputs and Outputs. And for your input, you're going to want to choose AI Noise Cancelling Input. Now, if you don't see it at first, just put in a pair of headphones, maybe speakers, and that should pop right up. And for your output, speakers, headphones, whatever you use to get the feedback back from your sound. All right, so we go back into FL Studio, click on Options, Audio Settings, and you're gonna see Primary Sound Driver. Now that's the main sound driver for FL Studio, but you're gonna to wanna to change that to ISO All V2 for FL Studio 20. Expand it and click on your USB device that's connected to your audio interface. Now, after that's done, all we have to do is test it out and record. Checking, checking, one, two, three. This is your Moki audio interface connected to your microphone. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So, like if you like it, subscribe if you want to, and comment below and let me know what you think. All right, till next time. Peace.